Hey everyone, welcome to another video from Fluffsoft.net. This video is going to serve as a guide on how to use the Nightmare Zone Range AFK program. So let's get started. First things first, we're going to come to Fluffsoft.net. We're going to click here and we're going to download the Nightmare Zone AFK Range program. We're going to come here, we're going to open our downloads folder, and we're going to run the program. For now, we're going to leave it off to the side while I explain a few other things before we get this program going. So let's talk about our gear setup real fast. You can use any gear that you want to use. Um, any range gear will be fine. We like to use Range Void for the bonuses that it provides. Um, and you can swap out any of these components. So for a cheaper version, you can use the god d high boots and you can use like a fury or something like that or even less if you don't have those you can use a glory um, basically any of these are can be swapped out uh, you can use better items if you wish and that'll get you the max experience per hour from using this program next let's talk about our inventory if you're using prayer potions they need to be on this top row only Typically, you will only need about two prayer potions. Uh, we just brought a third one because just to show that they go on the top row here. Um, one dose of prayer potion will be drank for every entire row of absorptions. So once all four of these have been drank, it will take one sip and will, you know, bring your um, prayer back to what it needs to be. Next is the absorption potions. The absorption potions will be drank in their entirety at every interval that you specify. Uh, we're going to talk about that later. Typically we use a 30 minute interval, um, but this was tested on a level 99 defense count, so the rate at which you need to drink your absorptions may vary based on uh, how fast you kill the monsters or how much damage you can take based on your defense level. So, the absorption potions go from the second row all the way down to the next to last row and will be automated all the way through. The final row has super ranging potions. And these can only be on the bottom row. The program will take a drink of the super ranging potion each time your boost is about to expire. That way you're always at maximum um, boost and you're getting the most XP you can. Uh, unfortunately the way it's written right now we can only have four of these. Uh, we may, might make it configurable in the later in the future where you can have a second row of them if you wish. Uh, but that will cut into your absorptions and you'll have to you know, figure out the balance. Uh, but For the most part this will last you a, a pretty long time. Uh, typically it will last about four hours or so before you've finished all of these. So next, we're going to go to our attack style. I like to use Rapid with a blowpipe. And make sure that your auto retaliate is on. The final thing is quick prayers. So make sure that all of your protection ones are off to save prayer. Uh, make sure everything else is off. And we just want to enable Rapid Heal. What Rapid Heal does is it will allow you to reset the timer on when your HP is about to go up to like 2 after eating your rock cake. And you'll see it go back up to 2 um, before this program starts. So let's go ahead and set up the program. I want you to notice how I'm, I have the RuneScape window focused um, and this is not focused. So what we want to do when we're setting this up is we're going to keep the focus on this the entire time. So let's follow the prompts and get this set up ready to go. The first step is to place your cursor over the prayer icon and hit any key to continue. What that will do is grab the coordinates of the prayer icon so that it will know where to click for it. Next we're going to get the location of your top left item in your inventory. If you don't have one here, so if you're not using prayer potions, what we typically do is just take an absorption potion and move it up there and we can then use that as our reference guide for where to click. 
So once our mouse is placed over the top left inventory item, we're going to hit any key. And, I'm sorry, we have to keep our focus over here. We have to place our cursor over that with this window focused. And press any key to continue. Now, we want to enter the amount of time in minutes that you want to run this for. You will automatically be logged off after six hours of gameplay, no matter what. So we have allowed for up to 360 minutes, or six hours, for this program to run. And it works pretty well. But for this guide, we're just going to do 60 minutes. We're not actually going to let it run that long, but just as an example. Next, are we using absorption potions? Most people are, so yes, we are. Now what this says to do is to drink your absorptions all the way up to 300 before you begin so that way you have a good enough buffer that you're not going to die between when the program starts and when it first drinks your first uh, absorption potion. So what we're going to do is we're going to calculate how long it takes for us to lose 200 points. So a quick way to do that is to go into a dream with your HP at 1 uh, and do the prayer flicking on your own or you can use this program to do the prayer flicking, flicking for you that's fine um, and what you can do is you can see how long it takes to lose 50 damage or 100 damage uh, so for example if you lose 50 damage in say 5 minutes then what you would do is you multiply that 5 minutes by 4 and you have 20 minutes so every 20 minutes, you're going to want to drink an entire absorption potion or 200 points worth of absorption. So we have found that at 99 defense, and with this, is, this setup, it takes about 30 minutes for us to lose 200 points of damage. So every 30 minutes, we're going to want to drink one of these. So over here, we're going to enter 30 minutes for the interval. Do you have prayer potions? I do technically have them in my inventory, I see them, um, but for this, we're not really going to be needing them. If you have a high enough prayer, it really won't drain that much. Uh, I think over the course of six hours, it will drain about 30 to 40 prayer points. Um, if you don't have that many prayer points, then I would say yes. Uh, and make sure that you have a, at least one or two prayer potions here. It should only drink one of them, maybe two of them. Um, but if you are using prayer potions, make sure they're here. For this guide, we are not going to be using prayer potions. Do you have super range potions? Yes, we do. Again, they need to be on the bottom row, so let's not forget that. And they also all of them need to be full. So we're going to, again, reiterate that and hit any key to continue. Enter your range level. Our range level will determine how often we need to take another dose of super range so that our boost is always at its maximum. So at level 99 range, I'm just going to enter that here, and we're good to go. So next, we're going to go get the program set up, or we're going to get RuneScape set up and ready to go so that we can go ahead and run this and be good to go. So we're going to right click on Dominic, we're going to do a customizable rumble. Um, this is the same setup as listed on our website. So I'll go to the how to use guide and this is the recommended usage guide. This will explain the setup of everything. So what we're going to do is going to drink the potion. It's going to again show you the monsters. It's the same as it's on the website. We're going to hit oh, actually before we do this Guzzle our rock cake down. We're gonna get all the way down to like two or one HP. So that way, when the monsters attack us, the maximum damage we can take is one. And that will make your absorptions and it will make your prayer last a lot longer. So we'll go down to about two or one. And we're gonna accept and go back in. So when we go in, again, remember your hit points are at 1, so you need to be very careful. 
we're going to come to this spot here right between the armor. One, two, three, I'm sorry, zero, one, two, three, four, five. And we're going to drink our absorptions. This is important. If you don't drink them and you forget, then you're going to get one shot and kill. So what we typically do is drink all the way up to 300 just to be safe. Um, notice how your health has regenerated back up to 2. What we need to do is guzzle it back down to 1. Once this is at 1, typically we like to do a manual prayer flick. And from that point, you have a minute to get this program running. Fortunately, we already have it running. So all we have to do is bring the focus over to here. We're going to place our cursor over the icon. And we're going to hit any key to continue. So what it's going to do is it's going to prayer flick for you real fast. We're going to come down, and we're also going to drink a super range dose. And that will boost us all the way back up to maximum range. So now you can see I'm on 118 range. And yeah, that's about it. So every uh, few seconds or so it will click and it will keep you logged in and it will keep your health at 1 and you will constantly gain range experience. Uh, the program will show the time that you started, the predicted time that you're going to end, and how much time until your next click is going to happen. Um, also in using this program it's not recommended that you're playing a game or, or doing anything else. This is really for use when you're at work or you're sleeping or you're out to dinner or something like that where you're not at your computer. If you want to run this in a virtual machine like some, pro some people have mentioned then it's fine. Then you can run this in a virtual machine and not have any issues and use your computer as normal. So what this program is going to do is it's just going to run and it's going to prayer flick uh, between every 35 and 55 seconds to keep that HP at 1 and to keep you attacking. Also note, before you go in, make sure that you have enough um, Zolra scales and darts and everything like that just so that you're good to go. So I'm just going to let this run for a bit. So you can see how it works when it prayer flicks, everything like that. Um, I don't think we're going to get to the absorption because, you know, it takes, it's going to take 30 minutes for it to click on absorption. So once this, click, I'll, once this clicks, I'm going to manually show you how the absorption works. So it just clicked, so we have another 43 seconds for me to explain this to you. Um, what it's going to do is after every interval that we entered, so for this account it was 30 minutes. So after 30 minutes it's going to come down here and it's just going to drink an entire absorption potion. And then it'll go back to normal. Um, and that's, that's pretty much it. That's all the action that this thing's really going to do. Um, and again, once the entire row of absorptions have been drank, it's going to take a sip of prayer potion just to keep you topped off so that you don't run out of prayer. And that's it. I'm just going to let this run for a little bit. And I hope you guys have a good day. And thank you for supporting us. And we'll be releasing some new stuff shortly. Thanks again.